you can have your own unique BitLocker recovery key, if you watch this till the end. However, I need you to think outside the box, school will never teach this and be patient with me as I process this information. Remember, this content is exclusive to this channel and should not be copied elsewhere. This is an educational purpose only, don't hack into other computers and devices. First, let's unlock the encrypted drive D. This will allow us to add a new BitLocker recovery key. To unlock the drive, you will enter your current 48-digit BitLocker recovery key. Please follow the instructions on the screen carefully. Now you can see on the command prompt screen that, your encrypted drive D was unlocked successfully. A second check can be done by observing the status of the padlock icon. It should be unlocked. The next step, is to enter the following command line to overview all your BitLocker recovery keys in your drive D. In the command prompt screen, you will see the BitLocker recovery key highlighted to help you identify it easily. This is the same recovery key you used to unlock drive D in the previous step. Now let's create a new BitLocker recovery key for drive D. For demonstration purposes, I will enter 480 separated by hyphens. In your case, you can enter numbers you will remember easily, such as your birthday or graduation date. Ok let's check again, make sure the command line displayed on the command prompt screen was correct. Once you are happy with your new version of BitLocker recovery key, press enter to continue. Since you now have a unique and easily remembered BitLocker recovery key, you can choose not to save it in a secure location. This is so convenient, right? Let's use the following command line on the command prompt screen to verify that we have two BitLocker recovery keys. The old one created by our PC. And the new one we just created. Once confirmed. We can delete the old recovery key. This is an old recovery key, we will delete it soon. And this is a new recovery key. In the command prompt window, you can type this command line to delete your old BitLocker recovery key for drive D. Please remember that once deleted, you will no longer be able to recover your data using this key. However, this shouldn't be a concern because you now have a new recovery key. Ok let's check again, make sure the command line is correct otherwise it won't work. Press enter to continue. Now! Your old BitLocker recovery key has been permanently deleted. Let's check what recovery options are available for drive D. Congratulations we successfully created your own unique BitLocker recovery key, something we initially believe was impossible.
This new key serves as your primary recovery option, with your BitLocker password acting as a secondary backup in case you ever forget it. Of course, I am confident you won't forget your new recovery key. This is your BitLocker password ID. It is crucial to keep this ID and avoiding deleting it. Deleting this ID will corrupt your BitLocker password.